message came from the internet. All right, Brandy, what's the story? What's going on? Oh, we're gonna, going to go to New Mexico for the story where a dr- suspected drunken intruder actually kicked his way into a closed convenience store, took a pack of cigarettes, but what he did might surprise a lot of other people after that. Las, excuse me, the Las Cruces Police Department said in a Facebook post that Ellis Batista, who's about 24, and another man knocked on the locked door of Bradley's convenience store about 3.30 a.m. Sunday, but the store, which was usually open 24 hours a day, happened to be closed that day. Well, that wasn't doing it for Elias. He had to kick the door in, the lower panel, until it broke, giving him access to the store. He goes up, finds his um, brand of cigarettes, grabs a pack of it, takes $6, shows the $6 to the security camera, leaves it on the counter, and then turns around and walks back out the exact same way he came in. Wow. Yeah, a witness actually called 911, and the guy was arrested nearby the store. Uh, detectives noted that th- they did have to charge him for breaking and entering, but the other guy who was with him was not charged for anything. You know, I know everybody who smokes or, you know, d- lives in the house with a smoker, smoker realizes just how expensive smoking has become. Mm-hmm. It's crazy expensive. But feel good knowing that whatever you're paying for your cigarettes, if you're a smoker, this guy's paying a whole lot more for him now. I mean, that's going to be a big old check that he's going to have to cut to somebody. Man, uh, you, but you know, obviously you'd have to think these guys have to be super, super drunk to think this is a good idea. But if you're super, super drunk, it's hard to count out $6, too. So at least some credit for that. And look, he's clearly an animal, but at least he's an honest one. A lot of people would have just come in and taken whatever they wanted, money out of the register, or whatever. And there's nothing worse than a dishonest criminal. If you're going to do terrible things... At least have some integrity about it.